so firstly in a mixing bowl i am adding in the sliced lady's finger then i'm adding in turmeric powder squeezing in half a lemon red chili powder basin flour and i'm going to mix this well and keep this aside now on a medium flame in a pan i'm adding in some oil 3 2 to 3 tablespoons of oil measurements are in the description box please check them out going to add this uh mixed lady's finger into this and saute this on high flame for 4 to 5 minutes till till all the stickiness of the lady's finger is gone So once the stickiness is gone I'm going to keep this aside. Now in the same pan I'm adding in some oil as well as a bit of a ghee. Now I'm going to add in the chopped potatoes and again saute this for 4 to 5 minutes on high flame till the potatoes are fried a bit, you know, 4 to 5 minutes is much enough. Now I'm going to remove this and keep this aside. Drain the oil, okay? Now in the same pan with the ghee and oil, I'm adding in the bay leaf and dry red chilies. Saute for a minute and adding in cumin seeds once they start to splutter. I'm adding in finely chopped onions. Salt and I'm going to cook the onions till they have turned light brown. Once the onions have turned light brown, I'm going to add in coriander powder, red chili powder, cumin powder, turmeric powder and kashmiri lal mirch powder mix all of this well together now i'm adding in finely chopped tomatoes adding a little bit of water since i felt it the it was too dry the masalas may get burnt so mix in well and cover and cook till the tomatoes are soft and mushy in the middle add in the paste of ginger garlic again mix in combine well and again cover and cook till the tomatoes are soft so once the tomatoes are soft give this a quick mix you can see all the water is gone that i've added okay to that i'm adding in the fried potatoes combine and half a cup of curds combine cover and cook for about 5 minutes after 5 minutes now i'm adding in some water don't make it too gravy since this is a curry okay mix in once and cover and cook till the potatoes are well cooked after that i'm going to add in the fried lady masala coated lady's finger adding in bit of garam masala combining all this well together before that i'm adding in a bit of water and then combining you can add the water according to your preference but this is a curry so keep a limit addition of water okay lastly i'm going to add in the salt mix in well and going to cover this and cook this for about 10 to 15 minutes till the potatoes and lady's finger is completely cooked okay at the end you can see this is how the consistency should look like 
give this a quick stir when you cover and cook this for about 10 to 15 minutes don't forget to saute in between okay now you can see that the potatoes are cooked well okay and this is how the consistency should look like now turn off the flame and this is ready to be served this can be had with rice as well as dosa or chapati or roti okay so guys don't forget to give this video a like share it among your friends and family and subscribe to my channel if you haven't and i will see you next time until then take care guys bye bye